Hi, for our time together today, I'm assuming that you already feel comfortable reading short vowel words. So we are going to be focusing on what happens to a short A word when there is another vowel added next to the A. Before we look at that, I'd like to comment that when you have a single vowel followed by one or more consonants, then that vowel will be a short vowel sound when you read it. It's called a closed syllable. And when a word has a closed syllable or um, one of the syllables in a word is a closed syllable, then that is a short vowel sound. So this would be a. Ah. No matter what these letters are, this would be a ah if it followed the rules. What you're going to notice in the words that we read today is that when you see an A next to an I, it becomes a vowel team spelling. And AI no longer says A, ah, it says A, the long A sound. And it usually <clears throat> will be in the middle of a word. In fact, I'm going to go so far to say it will always be in a word where there will be a consonant after it. There can be words that start with AI, so it won't always be the middle, but it most often is the middle and it always will have a consonant after it. All right, let's see what happens when we read some words together. Starting with M-A-D, mad. Now we put the I next to it, AI becomes A, and the word is made. And this is the kind of made that you could hire a person to clean your house and they might be known as a maid. Next one, lad. A lad is a little boy. That's another word for a little boy. Now when we have an AI together, the AI will say A. So the word becomes laid. I laid down because I was tired. Next one, clam. That would be a shell, a fish, uh, not a fish, an animal that you would find in the ocean, a clam. Now we have an AI, so the vowel sound changes to A and the word becomes claim. From clam to claim. Next one, pan. When we put the vowel team together, it says A and the word is pain. Pan to pain. Plan. With the AI together, the sound is A. The word becomes plain. Today, I have on a plain pink shirt. It means there's nothing else um, besides pink. From plan to plain. And there is more than one spelling for plain. That's why it's important to associate the spelling with what it means. Pal, that's a synonym for the word friend, a pal or a friend. Now I have AI together. It says A, pale. This is the kind of pale that means a bucket, pale. Next, bran. Put the AI together, A brain. Notice how I'm seeing the vowel first. It's a great way to decode a word. If I'm not sure what the word is, I look for the vowel, think of what sound that vowel makes, and then use that sound to read the word. From bran to brain. I've got a few more. Man. Put the AI together. It says A. Main. This is the kind of main that means it's very important, like the main idea or the most important idea. There's more than one spelling for main. Bat. AI says A. Bait. What are you going to use for your fishing bait? Ran. AI says A. Rain. Final practice word today, pad. AI together, A, paid. Hopefully this is something you 
We'll practice again so that you can get more proficient at it and your reading power can grow. Watch for those vowel themes, AI. They will say A in any word that follows the rules.